Welcome to the Cube. Millions of people went online Tuesday night in order to monitor a flight carrying the U.S. House of Representatives Speaker Nancy Pelosi to Taiwan. Now, according to Flight Radar, which is a live uh, flight tracking website, over 708,000 people were following the airplane's course, making it the most live tracked flight of all time. And Millions more people were live streaming the airplane's course on Weibo, which is the popular Chinese social media platform. But the main question is, why has Nancy Pelosi's flight generated so much attention? Well, she's the first high-ranking U.S. politician to visit Taiwan in over 25 years. And it's also important to mention that as of Sunday, a trip to Taiwan was not logged into her official itinerary after Beijing issued multiple warnings against the surprise visit to this island that it considers its uh, territory. So that's why hundreds and thousands of people were really uh, wondering whether Pelosi was going to make a surprise appearance after her departure uh, from Malaysia. And Chinese uh, Foreign Ministry uh, said that it will respond to uh, Pelosi's uh, surprise visit with resolute, forceful and effective action. And Chinese state media even reported that its army will conduct six days of live military drills in the Taiwan Strait, which has really angered Taiwanese government officials, which have accused uh, Beijing of using force instead of peaceful means. And so this visit has been so controversial that even the White House advised against it. According to Politico, U.S. President Joe Biden even said that the military thought that this was not a good idea. But the 82-year-old politician uh, defended her surprise visit uh, by tweeting that it honors America's unwavering commitment to supporting Taiwan's uh, vibrant democracy. And although the U.S. does maintain diplomatic relations uh, with Beijing, it does remain Taiwan's main international supporter, and it even has to legally provide any sort of uh, defense if the island is attacked. And when it comes to Taiwan, uh, it argues against the Chinese authorities saying that only its people can decide of the island's political future.